Clinton County School District is reflecting on its achievements over the past year. Superintendent Anita Huggins delivered the state of the school's address earlier today. That's right. News 2's Katie Fong Bongza was at the event and she joins us live in the studio with what is next for the district. Katie. Carolyn Aaron, this year's theme is Kids First. Superintendent Huggins' first address outlined the district's goals and the challenges they are trying to overcome over the next three years. Superintendent Anita Huggins highlighting CCSD students in her first state of the district address. Officials say the district has been able to make significant progress on state report cards. I would say the increase in student achievement um, is one of the most significant things that we've been able to do since I um, have had the pleasure of leading in this district. They've also improved on reading and math scores, but as part of the Vision 2027 program, they're putting more emphasis on reading, hoping to get all students reading on grade level by fifth grade. Getting students on grade level has to do with the it requires a lot of different things, including access to high quality literature, um, rigorous instruction with a mindset by educators that kids can and kids will. It requires um, a unique skill to intervene when students aren't where they need to be. And it um, requires me as a superintendent to make sure that teachers have what they need to provide resources to children who need it the most. Another step towards student success, shifting the district to a weighted student-based funding model, which will allocate $32 million across all schools in the district based on student needs, funding some traditionally underserved schools. It's critically important in the system that if we're going to make sure kids have what they need to be successful after they leave us, that we tell the truth about the challenges we face and the data associated with students, particularly students of color, who are underachieving compared to their white peers. So it's really critically important that in this system we have honest conversations about our needs and what it's going to take to get us to where our children deserve to be. Huggins says another one of her greatest achievements has been getting teacher and staff salary increases, making CCSD one of the top paying school districts in the state. Reporting in studio, Katie Fongvonksa, Count On 2. Katie,